We're going to go and have a quick look at um, Tiger Moss Kilt Kilturn and Stakes win, um, which was pretty impressive. This is it back here. It actually casts the rest of the field up to the two to the three pacemakers in the race um, and two of its stable mates before it runs away from them. Indeed, stretch to win by four lengths. So, despite being good on paper, it's visually impressive for the, for that one simple fact that. Um, it did cut the rest of the field up to the two pacemakers before running away from them as well. So, you know, it did do a bit of the extra work to bring the rest of the field up to them um, before proving clearly superior. But we'll pick them up from here. So this is Tiger Moth back here in the um, Coolmore Colours in fourth. As you can see, it's on the front end of that group from the tearaways. Now, as these three start to extend, you'll see Tiger Moss still in fourth, bringing the rest up to the three leaders. And the way he puts the race to bed very quickly um, and has the others off the bit, it's pretty impressive. Remembering this is only his fourth career start as well. So this is Tiger Moss here. Okay, this is him into the stretch front. Gets his stable mate. Once he really shakes him up, he goes away. And he's strong through the line now. You have a bit of a query from the dam side of the pedigree, pedigree whether um, this one would get 3,200 metres strongly being out of a um, good Mujadil mare. And um, her halves, this one's halves, uh, are better over the shorter trips. I'll get into the breeding of it soon, but strong through the line over the 2400, brought the rest of the field up to it and won it impressively and beat a very good field, um, as I've suggested uh, in the video on the form coming out of the race. So that's Tiger Moth winning the Kilturnan, the Paddy Power Kilturnan, um, by four at his fourth career start. Scope for plenty more yet. Uh, will he say 3200? That's the next question. Thanks.